This is the Correction Academy. It's a cornerstone of the Learning and Training Institute of the Department of Corrections. We have in-service training going on on a daily basis. Training is 15 weeks. Everything from IPC to uh, physical training, responding to alarms, everything as it relates to um, being a, a correction officer. It's an eye opener, actually. It's um, a lot of things that you know that you think you're afraid of and you probably won't be able to handle. And um, through the classes and the lessons they're showing us here at the academy, they show us that you can take charge, show you that um, these inmates are not only inmates, but they're also people, and um, that we have to provide certain what they call the three C's, care, custody, and control for them. As far as that, when they need certain things, like um, one of my crew stated that um, it, it's like management. We have to be able to manage these people and help them out. I just finished my MBA, and a lot of people said to me, well, why would you get an MBA and go into corrections? Really, a lot of being a correction officer is being management straight as soon as you walk into the jail. Mm -hmm. So you have to manage a lot of situations. You have to manage a lot of different people, sometimes up to 50 or 100. Mm -hmm. Give your commands. That will give you, give you that energy that you need, okay, because this is about saving your life, all right? I got through chemical training here. I got sprayed with the OC. Um, I take it that I was a swimmer and used to having chlorine in my eyes every day that I was able to get through um, the OC and, and get it out. But it, w it was different. It was difficult not being able to see as you're fighting someone or trying to safeguard this gun and saying, I can't let it go because someone will shoot me with it if I let the gun go. You know, it, it was a very interesting situation. There's a romantic notion of the law enforcement officer. It's the sole person, a man or a woman, in my case, a uh, lone man that's going to stand the post in a difficult situation. There's going to be times in this career, in the next 20 years, it's going to be me against them. But what this department brings is a sense of teamwork and camaraderie. And I like that spirit of togetherness. So I'm looking forward to wearing the uniform and working with my colleagues and my coworkers together as a team.